What's going on guys? Now Rainbow here with another reaction video. And I'm going to be taking a look at uh, another requested video. Uh, this one was requested by DE Shadow. Um, this is titled Fly Like You SFM uh, by Bench Thief Productions. Uh, came out, I think about five months ago. Um, in terms of the creator, I think the only other video of theirs I've seen was the their uh, destabilized SFM video that I reacted to a while back as well. So, uh, kind of, a, at least from that video, I kind of have a basic idea of what their style is going to look like. Um, but other than that, I don't really know much about the video itself. Like, uh, I don't know this is going to be based off another uh, uh, fandom song or this uh, if it's even a music video at all, so not really sure, but go ahead, uh, jump into it and see what happens. Why they want to steal pinches in the first place, I'm not sure. Maybe just screw with Byron Bonbon. Bon. Who knows? Hello, my faithful listeners. This is DJ Pone 3 coming at you with a special update. Our favorite boy is in the wasteland, Velvet Remedy. Okay, follow our question. Jazz Club off Celestial Highway 49. <laughs> Do me a favor and swing by to show her some love. She brings you a brand new track she calls Fly Like You. Okay, yeah, so it's a song. Hey, Steel Hooves. I see you over there. Hey, little pip. Wing Bonner. Oh, 
Uh-oh. That dragon? Oh. Where did you get those glasses? Delay's playing Wailers, okay. <laughs> oh my god. Wow, that was cute. <laughs> that's a that's a that's a fun little way to make the uh the outro. Okay, so yeah, so once I realized it was the uh, Fallout Quest, I kind of knew it was gonna be Wasteland Whalers, uh, uh, Wasteland Whalers song. Pretty cool. Um, I'm I'm curious about the. That little, little dragon fight there, and that guy with the red eye. I, like, I thought there was actually something that was going to happen with them. Uh, I guess they're just showing that they were hearing it or something. Like I don't know. <laughs> and maybe there's, maybe they're probably important in the uh, the story. I haven't actually read it yet, but um, yeah, I, don't know. I, I, I had expected something to happen with that, but it really was just. The whole thing was just her singing on the stage, kind of telling her story. Um, I mean, animation-wise, I mean, yeah, like I said, I, I saw uh, their destabilized SFM, so I kind of knew what the animation style was going to look like. You know, it was not bad. Um, I never like to be, like, overly critical of um, the way people are, uh, people skill with SFM. Just cause I'm shit at doing <laughs> shit at doing uh, animation, I do, I don't have the patience to try and learn it. So, you know, to, even if it's not you know like Argo Damon uh, level of skill, you know, it's still a lot uh, a lot better than anything I could do. So I I love it anyway. Um, Lip sync was pretty good. You know, not like a hundred percent perfect, but it was pretty well done. The uh, the vital scratch part though kind of surprised me. Like at first, I thought it was actually like she was somehow teleporting herself there, but I guess it was actually just part of part of her act, I suppose. Since I guess uh, that w the whole thing was just a hologram anyway, so I I guess that was all, I guess that was just part of her act. But yeah, that was pretty cool. Uh, I really enjoyed that. Um. Yeah, uh, other than that, yeah, I'm not really sure there's anything else I could think of to mention about that. It was a pretty straightforward video, to be honest. I mean, other than talking about the animation, the song, and that one uh, dragon fight bit, uh, it, it was just the uh, stage scene. That, that was about it. <laughs> not much else I could think of to say about it, so... 
Um, that was Fly Like You SFM by Bench Steve Productions. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Take it easy. Amen.